G'day folks, Uncle Nackus here. Now look, boomerangs are awesome and they're great fun to throw. So when Danesy announced the Off Cuts Only 23 challenge, I knew exactly what I had to make. Now I've got a scrap piece of plywood here somewhere amongst all this shamozzle and I reckon that's all I'm going to need to make a snappy little boomerang. Now when I was a kid in high school back in the early 80s, Yep, that's right, back in the 1900s, it was a study of natural selection at its finest as everybody brought a boomerang to school to throw at recess and lunchtime. It was great fun, but also kind of dangerous due to the actual number of boomerangs being thrown at the same time, which of course led to it eventually being banned. Well, fancy that, something fun being banned just because some kid lost an eye. Outrageous. Okay, let's not waste any more time and get this boomerang shape cut out. Shouldn't be too hard, should it? Don't do what I just did with the circular saw. I use the circular saw because you finish up with a cleaner cut than using a jigsaw. But what's happened is that this piece is now loose, which is going to make cutting around that circle a little bit tricky. So for the rest of it, I'm just going to use a jigsaw to cut around the entire shape. Now the edges, they may be a bit rougher, but we should be able to sand those back. Now when using the jigsaw, don't force the cut. Let the machine do the work and use a fine tooth blade. Mine's a 14 toother and as it turned out, cutting that dodgy end wasn't as bad as I expected. Now with boomerangs, you can virtually make them any shape you like. And to make them fly, you need a leading edge to cut through the air and a trailing edge to create the lift, just like the wing on a plane. Now to create those specialized edges, just use a sanding machine or even just some hand sandpaper or some description to get the desired shape. Now with all three of those trailing edges sanded, the next thing we need to do is just to round over the leading edge on all three of those wings. And then to finish this off, we'll give it a good old sand just to get rid of any rough edges. Now, check this out. That's not a bad looking logo. Looks pretty cool. Hey, just a quick one. What do you call a boomerang that doesn't come back? A stick. <laughs> Classic. Dear oh dear. Just getting worse with each video. Now most people will look at that and go, yep, that looks done. Let's go down the park and take it for a spin. But I'm not normal. I'm going to give this a paint job using a technique that I've never used before. That's either going to make it or break it. I'll let you be the judge. Alrighty, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Alrighty, let's give it a go. Bit of white paint. Alrighty, stand back folks. Here we go. Now that looks pretty cool. <laughs> so that's it folks, and I have to say that I'm pretty happy with the first attempt. Hopefully though, the extra weight of that paint doesn't throw out the aerodynamics. But regardless of that, I think the effect looks absolutely awesome and deserves a big thumbs up. So here we are folks, got a big wide open space, so I shouldn't do too much damage. Let's give this a toss and see if it comes back. Fingers crossed. Here we go. Looking all right to come and come back to me. Oh, just missed him. I think we need a bit more wind because that's quite crucial in throwing a boomerang. But I think you get the idea. These things seriously are so much fun. Love it. Here he is, here he is. Oh. Too bad, just like my school report. Room for improvement. Okay, 
Let's give it another one. <laughs> Seriously, folks, these things are so much fun. Do yourself a favor, go get one or make one, and uh, it gets the kids out of the house. Alrighty, good stuff. Now, if you and the kids want to have a go at making one of these awesome little boomerangs, I'll leave a link to the plans down below in the description box, so do yourself a favour and check those out. And if you're interested in seeing other novelty woodworking type projects, make sure you check out my playlist, which should be up on the screen over there. Alrighty, as long as my dodgy old shoulder holds out, I'm off to fine tune my boomerang throwing skills. So till next time, be good, be safe, and I'm out of here. Cheers.